I like putting my messages on the shoes and my stories. The message actually probably lasts longer maybe than the shoes do. These shoes get noticed for their unique soles. Hi, I'm Mihaela Koman with WatchMonjo.com and today we'll be speaking with John Fluvog. Fluvog is, it like, it means lots of different things. It's, it's the shoe, it's the style, it's a feeling, and it's an emotion. So it's all of those things. It's not just a shoe, I think. And what type of person would you say wears those shoes? Mostly the thinking people or artistic people. Maybe they're in graphic arts, maybe they're in education even, or in the entertainment industry, but really everything. You can be a secretary and be into Fluvog and wear them. If you wear them, you'll get compliments, you'll get people noticing you yeah for sure in your opinion what are shoes to an outfit shoes are the outfit come on you start with the shoes and then you, then you build the outfit around them why go the other way around that's like so lame so you've recently been named one of the top 10 most innovative fashion companies in the world how did you do that in a field that is ever-changing if I really knew that I'd be a lot smarter I think we as people and as individuals are very powerful Um, we have our, our own ideas, our very good ideas. In order to stay on top of things, I've just learned to be more myself. Have you always been a shoe designer? This is my 40th year of being business. I started out being a retailer and then partway through my career, I began to move into design and into original things. I went through a time when in the, uh, probably the mid 80s, when I got into sort of alternative kind of punk styles and and you, you would go, I'd go to Europe or go to Italy and you just couldn't find anything like that so I started to do my own look or my own feeling then and I think as well it was to be able to stay in business just chasing fashion is like trying to catch a soap in the bathtub you know you can just never catch it because once you catch it it's gone so I like the idea of being a little further ahead and thinking further ahead yeah so when you design your shoes what is more important the look or the comfort level I have to admit it's more that for me I start with the look Yeah, yeah. And then I make them comfortable. I'm also really want my footwear to be repairable and reusable. I have new soles, I have new heel lifts, I have parts and pieces, so you can keep them going. I heard that in order to work for you, a person has to believe in their heart and soul that you are the handsomest man alive. Is that true? Absolutely. It's a little box I have to check off. Wow. No, that's <laughs> just a story. No. But if they think it, it's good, huh? I think the most important thing to me in my business is to have good energy around me and good people. If I see people saying bad things about somebody else or backbiting in my office or negative things happening, uh, unloving things, I stop it. It's really important to me. Well, thank you very much. It was a pleasure speaking with you. It's been great. Thank you.